Hello world, I'm Morgan Foster, and you may know me as the former lead singer of Common Shiner, the current lead singer of In Threes, um, Avery's dad. Uh, or if you do not know who I am at all, uh, I hope that Avery's cute enough uh, that you'll stick around for the rest of my little video here. Okay? So not too long after Common Shiner decided to go on hiatus, I played a solo show uh, with a couple friends, and I played some newer songs and some older obscure ones. And it suddenly dawned on me as I was playing them that I, I would be really sad if these songs just died because they never, for some one reason or another, they never found their way onto a Common Shiner album. So that's what got me thinking maybe those tracks, along with some new ones I was working on, would be perfect for a solo project. And then I thought, I wonder, I wonder if all my musician friends would help me. Hi. I'm Jeff from Jeff Brown and the New Black. My name is Mike Mimoni. I play in a band called Mutz. Hey, I'm Laura Green. Hey, everybody. I'm Michael Brooks from Common Shiner. Uh, I'm Zach from the Wandering Boys. Hey, it's Jess. Hi, I'm uh, Jorge Leal. Hi, my name is Matt. Hey, this is VJ from Common Shiner. Hi, I'm Aaron from Community Christian Church. Hey, this is Cecil. Hey, I'm Jake. Hey, this is Jordan from In Threes. Hi, everyone. This is John Schieber. I'm totally stoked to be making this record with Morgan. Very excited to be a part of this musical project. And I'm looking forward to playing on this album with Morgan Foster. Can't wait to tickle those ivories. I'm looking forward to being a part of Morgan's album. And I'm very excited right now. I'm so psyched to be on Morgan Foster's next album. Uh, about the album. And I'm positive adjective to be on this album with Mor- so excited to be working on this project with Morgan. And I am thrilled to be on this album with Morgan. <laughs> and I am super stoked to be on this album with Morgan. And then I thought, what if I also recorded it at a studio run by my friends? So that's why I've decided to record right around the corner from my house here at the Foxhole, run by my good friend, Tim Frank. Hey. So recording here at the Foxhole uh, and collaborating with my friend Tim kind of feels like my whole Chicago journey has come full circle because Tim plays in a band as well called... Band Called Catch. The band is not called Catch. The band is called Band Called Catch. So probably just a few, three, four months after Common Shiner moved to Chicago uh, eight years ago. Wow. Holy um, God. We played a, a show with these guys uh, at Underground Lounge. And uh, best venue in the city. <laughs> if Underground Lounge is watching this, you're the best. <laughs> you're the best. We played with them and they were just like super cool and fun to hang out with. So we kind of kept in touch with them ever since. And so I've sort of been good buddies with Tim ever since then, eight years ago. So, you know, here it feels like it's just come full circle to, to work again with him. Look full pretty. circle. Say something. Circle of life. <laughs> it's a circle of life. <laughs> So I've decided to uh, call the project Foster, which uh, as you all would hopefully know by now that that is my last name. And it's going to be 10 uh, previously unreleased tracks, a few of which have provided the soundtrack of this video. So There's so many ways in which trying to make it these days in the music scene uh, is such a frustrating and soul-sucking experience. And so after years of worrying about that, I finally just wanted to create something because it could be beautiful and fun and meaningful to create without having to worry about what might happen to it beyond that. When I moved here uh, over eight years ago, the scene here was so warm and so welcoming and supportive that I was able to feel at home here almost immediately. And that's something that's very unique to Chicago in my experience. I'd always wanted to uh, kind of make an album that reflected that spirit and be able to bring in all of my friends to do an album together, but there was always so many reasons that that just wasn't going to work. And so I, I was thinking maybe a solo project is finally the, the chance to make that work. And luckily, as you saw earlier, all my friends said yes. But like with so many things in the music business these days, uh, I need your help. I really wish I didn't have to ask you for money for this, but you know, because I just can't afford to do this without your help. But I am planning on making it very worth your while. Uh, not just because I think that you'll like the songs, but uh, because I've also got some good rewards down the side here. Wait, which way is it? Is it that one? It's gotta be one of these. Which side? Who am I even talking to? There's no one else here. So any amount that you can give me will be really, really helpful. And your support just, it, it means the absolute world to me. Pencils? Who has pencils? Voiceovers. 
voiceover people and pencils. Of course they do. Seriously, um, I love all of you and thank you so much for supporting me in this. Uh, and hopefully we, I, I, I'm able to make some fun tunes with my friends that you all will really enjoy. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> and then, or you know, the circle of life, mm -hmm. like Lion King. Seen that movie? Did you get all that?